Northern Kenya has a long history of conflict. In Garissa County, this conflict has three dynamics, within clans, with neighboring counties, and across the border with Somalia. Now, new conflict drivers are heightening local tensions and providing challenges for traditional peace-building structures. Local peace committees in Garissa County are being supported by conciliation resources to strengthen community level and cross-border peace building and help them work more effectively with county and national governments. In September 2017, 10 peace builders traveled from Kenya to West Africa to learn from the district platforms for dialogue, a network of voluntary community peace building platform supported by conciliation resources and partners since 2010. These platforms work to overcome tensions and encourage discussions within communities and play a similar role to the local peace building committees in Kenya. The visit was an opportunity for Kenyan and West African peace builders to learn from each other's challenges and successes to help them improve their peace building work. District platform for dialogue. Uh, these are informal local structures that are organized at the border region. So four countries, Liberia, Guinea, Sierra Leone, and La Côte d'Ivoire. A maximum of between 10 to 15 uh, uh, a person comprising of men, women, youth, and uh, young ladies. The whole idea of sort of different organizations coming together on one platform to work to engage government to demand accountability was the sort of uh, the rallying call for the establishment of the DPD. The DPDs came in to structure based on their own willingness to have peace into their communities. We have some women who are co-chair to the DPDs. We have young people who serve as community mobilizers. Then we have refugees who attend the meetings of the DVDs to have them aware on how to live in the community. The reason it's important for DVD members to come from the community is because we live for our people. We work along with them, we eat with them, we sleep with them. So we will know their problems they are going through. We don't allow issues on community level to go into court. When there is conflict, we go and then carry on mediation, go in between there and find solution to that problem. Some of the reasons ranked in our Iberia country, which we can uh, take to account is that uh, people themselves are more participating in issues of peace. In areas we visited, people who are in conflict had to postpone their conflict resolution uh, mechanism until after the elections that are forthcoming are held. That tells you that uh, they have the peace making at heart. When there is problem within the youth, they come to us directly in order to find solution to that problem. We have some other people who are Muslims and we also have Christians. Any activities, we see to it that we involve them into that activities. Some of them, they are member of the DVD. Everybody is on the same level. The marginalized groups and the, and the women, the youth, they bring a perspective that is often sometimes forgotten. They create a lot of inspiration for other marginalized groups and also helps them to sort of change the negative situation that they have into a more positive one. Women are more involved in the community activities than you find the men. And so if you involve them in dialogue, you will find out that it will go on rapidly. Women are caretakers, women are providers, women are peacemakers.
everywhere we went in Liberia, most of the leaders are women. I will urge my community to allow the ladies to take part in uh, leadership. We dig behind issues that will affect our people, and that have become a case we have now recognized in, this, in the district as a decision makers. My relationship with the stakeholders is very cordial because when I say stakeholders, I'm talking about both national and local. That is Monrovia and here, even the region. We have this district commissioner council. We meet, we share our challenges, I share with them, and they too have grabbed that concept, and they are also using it to bring dialogue in their communities. <laughs> You host the community, that was a shakan, I stole all as much of a shakan and with glee, cover shakan hayan. Oh, good day. Oh, do let you did cut that key community how. Cover shakan how come has concern. Ayanaki. Local communities were very much coordinating with the central government, and both structures were trusting each other. And everybody has a part to, to play in peace building in Liberia. That's why you see everywhere. There's no guns, there's no uh, roadblocks. Nothing works without relationship between different actors in, in peace building. Liberia, you cannot talk of war. Everybody will tell you, oh, we don't want anything that will take us back to the civil war or anything similar to that. Peace builders, on one hand, have a role uh, to bridge the gap, to link communities with their governments, and also local uh, administrations have their role also reach out to the local people. So it's very important uh, to develop uh, that relationship. I'm a cross-border Somalia Hanukoto, any community policy that can lawyer can, I'm a KBR with the Duena Ad Ogurani, and a Duluda Hogiso or Hog Nalasio, Sidan Mela Antangne, Anguso Arangne, Sierra Leone, Every Coast, or community policy KBR, you good digger Pisca, K. Hoginian, Alawa Lakulman. Based on our input, our support, our intervention in some of the cross-border meetings and our own meetings organized between chiefs in communities along the Liberian and Southern border. Today, we can see our security are working together. Any problem can be solved if people come to listen and understand one another. Peace building should be seen as a way of life. Should peace building should not be seen as an activity or as, or as an event. Because for as long as we live as humans, there will always be conflict. مادام أيهين لف لف دبركة بلشك الصعب اللي نرضى أيكيهين لف دبركة إن أنا لو أذيك سنين وحيابها خلدانك أو جميع شب بلشدة وضع اللي نرضى. Peace starts with me and you. Everybody must own it. It should not be left to the government security organ. It should be all inclusive process. And I think when we believe in that, we are able to be great peacemakers. Guinea are not only about music. I want to make a new law. Number twenty is our God. God is Muslim. جيران أنا لا تروح وحم عن بنا نبدأ كم عاني نبدأ مع نجوز بقى وصلنا.